This is the Samsung Galaxy A30 and it wants to be your best friend for only 16,990 rupees. In return for your friendship and hard-earned cash, the A30 is offering some interesting features. The biggest headline over here is the Super AMOLED display that gives videos and movies the detail they deserve. Everything looks punchy and vivid, but the fairly large chin at the bottom isn't exactly eye candy. There's also a small notch at the top that houses the front camera. One thing that will definitely grab your attention is the plastic rear panel which reflects light to give you a beautiful streak-like pattern. Basically, if a zebra and a Samsung phone ever had a baby, this is what it would look like. The fingerprint scanner blends seamlessly into the back but is placed a tad bit high and wasn't always easy to use. You also get all the standard stuff you'd expect to see from a device in this price segment like a dual SIM slot, headphone jack, USB-C and a speaker grill. The Exynos 7904 processor coupled with 4GB of RAM ensures decent day-to-day -day performance while the Android Pie based One UI felt extremely smooth with no stuttering or sluggishness. However, things do start to fall flat in the camera department. In our testing, the dual rear camera clicked images that were often overexposed and lacked detail. Fortunately, the 16 megapixel front camera fared far better and will keep most selfie fans quite happy. Battery life is quite impressive. Even when being hammered by video streaming, Spotify playback, social media updates, the phone still had about 10% charge left at the end of the day. Overall, the Samsung Galaxy A30 is not a bad option to consider, but it's definitely not Samsung's best offering in the budget category. The company's less expensive Galaxy M30 is actually a good alternative as it's equipped with better features like a triple rear camera and a 5000 mAh battery.